Sullivan, Imogen, Sullivan, Bell. And on target number two, from Germany, Elisa Tackler. And the judge in the match is Clement Cesar. And on target number two, Elisa will start shooting first. So 24-year-old Elisa Tartler from Germany, the world number 38. She won a bronze medal at the first stage of the European Grand Prix in Lillishaw a few weeks back and took a bronze at the World Games in uh, Birmingham, Alabama last year. She goes up against the world number 366, the 28-year-old British archer Imogen Solomon Bell going for her first senior world ranking medal. Guaranteed silver, of course. And she's up against... Somewhat more experienced Elisa Tartler from Germany who will get the match underway. Elisa 10. Imogen 10. Long hold from Sullivan Bell, but results in a 10. Elisa 10. We've seen uh, Elisa before, like you said, in Lillish Hall this uh, preseason, but uh, just by these two shots, which is maybe ridiculous, Imogen but it nine. seems like she is more confident and more calm this time than uh, she was in uh, in Britain last time we saw her. Um, it seems like uh, really steady, really good shots. Elisa, eight. Pops it up into the eight for a 28, so opportunity here for Sullivan Bell. Imogen, nine. Puts it into the nine to match the scores. So 28 apiece, obviously subject to uh, the uh, target judge. So if despite that uh, less nervy approach from Elisa Tartler, so you, you're quite right. She was very nervy in that bronze medal match. There's a nervy match between the pair of them in Great Britain. Looking a little bit more solid. And you can see uh, the effect of the conditions here this week have had on the uh, footwear of the archers. In the 1 8 for Magdalena Smielkowska. There. In the quarters for Denise. And the British archers uh, acting as coach for and Imogen Sullivan Vell. Now, Chef, I mentioned earlier on, uh, I was going to come back to uh, another story of a family Lisa affair. Uh, yeah, Imogen, Imogen Sullivan Bell here. <laughs> yeah, I did indeed. Team Imogen Sullivan Bell here, who uh, is uh, in this gold medal match uh, well, for the first time at a senior event, has a famous dad, four time Olympic skier for Great Britain, Martin Bell. He's uh, her father. And uh, Martin has a, 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 well, I think a fairly unique uh, potential ahead of him with uh, one daughter here, Imogen, potentially in contention for uh, a Summer Olympic Games, perhaps Paris. And uh, his other daughter, Reese, is in the running for the British ski team for the Winter Olympics. So a very sporting Bell family. I think there's a brother, Graham. I think he also skied and went to five Olympics, I believe, as well. Her uncle. Elisa, nine. That's an impressive, uh, impressive uh, stats for uh, one family there. Yeah, they'll need big trophy cabinets at home, that's for sure. Imogen, seven. Elisa, yeah, a little bit of a bad release again, and I think a bit of a loss of tension there right before the release went, uh, or the, I, I was going to say release went off, but before the clicker went. Ten, Imogen. And that gives Imogen the chance to get back into this set. Nine, Elisa. Another opportunity here for 
Sullivan Bell. Need to tend to convert it. She goes high up into the eight for a 25. And for the first time, we've got a little bit of distance between these two as uh, Lisa Tartler provisionally claims those set points. Another curious one there. So two what, high left for uh, the Brit. One slap bang in the middle. And then uh, a little bit of a drift away from the middle from the first set for Tartler here. Yeah. Uh... I think Elisa had, I, I would say, one not so great shot um, in this uh, second set. Um, the first set she had a high eight, but it looked better than the eight that she now shot. Um, for Imogen, I think there is something going on um, with her left shoulder, and it's very difficult to see from the angles that we're getting. Uh, it seems like she's almost pushing it in too far or too hard, um, and therefore. Um, yeah, hitting uh, sorry left high, and I think that's what's going on. But it's difficult to see from the angles that we're getting on our screen. Yeah, interesting to see here as well that uh, there's uh, fellow teammates in the coaching box. I think it's uh, Claire Reisenweber in with uh, Elisa Tartler, and if I'm not mistaken, is that not Patrick Houston in with uh, Imogen yeah. Sullivan Bell? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's just not going in the right direction for Sullivan Bell right now. Things do change around, and it's certainly not been consistent from Tartler. Elisa seven. That's a really terribly long hold by Elisa there, and. Although it seems like she could keep composure, I, I guess there was more going on um, than what met the eye. But... Elisa, eight. A lot of movement and having to little, little release there, and she's going to run out of time here, Sullivan Bell. And I think she's just given up on that arrow. I think you can really feel the tension out there. Yeah. And, uh, a nine to finish off for a, a 24. And the scoreboard will show Sullivan Bell with a 14. Uh, so look, the, Chef, the, the scores are dropping down. Let's just put aside that, that final arrow uh, abandonment from Sullivan Bell. Uh, the conditions, it looks like it went dry for a bit, but now all the umbrellas are out again. Perhaps the rain is causing this? Yeah, I don't really know if it went completely dry, but in any case, uh, it, I think it's quite cold, it's quite uh, uh, brisk. And, and I think what might be happening to Imogen is that uh, her muscles are just slightly cold. Um, she is, um, I, I haven't seen her shoot that much, so I don't know what, what's her normal or her neutral form, but uh, her sh left shoulder is creeping up a little bit while she is pulling through the clicker. Um, and uh, although that's like a very normal movement to make if you're uh, cramped or if you're tired, it doesn't actually help you get through the clicker. Um, and I think that's also what uh, made her not shoot that shot because she couldn't get it through the clicker um, and then didn't know what to do and just uh, abandoned the whole idea of shooting it. Yeah, I'm not sure I've ever seen an athlete just abandon a shot before. Certainly seen them run out of time. Big deep breath for Imogen Sullivan Bell from Great Britain. As you can see, training by four and starts the fourth set very well with a nice little nine. Nine, Elisa. And this is what Elisa needs to do. She needs to at least tie Imogen to get the bronze Nine. medal. Imogen. Sorry, uh, the gold, gold medal. medal. <laughs> <laughs> Nine. 
Nine. Oh, she's matching just that, and I think the pressure's just off a little bit on Sullivan Belt. Nine. Yeah, shoots her second highest score of the match for a 27. Nine is all that's required for Veronica's Cup goal for Elisa Tartler, though. And she pops it into the nine for a 27, which matches Sullivan Bell and gives her the single point she needed for the gold medal and a 6-2 victory. The German following up. Brilliant start at the European Grand Prix first leg in Lillishaw, where she got a bronze medal with a gold here at the Veronica's Cup. Sullivan Bell from Great Britain. Gold medal match. Elisa, unofficially gold medal.